be ready for His redemption. And you see those sky united, eagle pets of tribulation. Papa God, go see me too. He go see me too. He go see me too. Papa God, go see me too. We go pets for His redemption. We are not intimidated. We will rise to stop corruption. Papa God will see me too. He will see me too. He will see me too. Papa God will see me too. For the future generation. And you see your son united for the people of his nation. Papa God go see me too. He go see me too. He go see me too. Papa God go see me too. Our leaders love this nation. They shall not be intimidated. If you touch one, you don't touch all. Papa God, go fetch for me. He go fetch for me. He go fetch for me. Papa God, go fetch for me. The National Grand Coalition Chairman and leader Dr. Dennis Bright said his party has been supporting policies of government that are in the best interest of the country and also opposing those they consider not in the interest of the country. According to him, the current state of the economy and the hardship on the people must be quickly addressed, adding that all political parties must put politics aside and collectively work in the interest of the country. A wake up call, I believe, uh, for all the authorities concerned to look at the issue of hardship not as through the political lens, but to look at it as a social problem that really exists. And an invitation also to those authorities uh, to get the real people around the table who can talk about the reasons why the people are suffering, why the prices are such, so that we can find ways and means in which we can alleviate, even temporarily, alleviate the suffering of the, of the ordinary man. The Western Area Chairman of the National Grand Coalition, Arthur Pierce, said changes in price of food items across the country, especially the sharp increase, must be quickly looked into. Congo Market is a popular market in the Western Area. Daniel Klein Deering and Fatma Tassisi are buyers. They were here to buy food items for daily household meal. They had concerns over increase in prices. As I came, uh, I see things in the market. Prices are skyrocketed. So, in turn, when you come to the market, at least to satisfy yourself, it's like too hard for you to meet what is in your pocket. So, uh, in time, I can say there are influences to this price going up. So, whosoever is in charge should try as best as possible to put things in place because the normal, for the average man, it's hard. You can't even get something over the fire to make food for yourself. So. The price is so expensive. We used to buy plasters 1,000 in Prasad. Now, it's just, let me just say, it's 5,000, 4,000. We used to buy pepper 1,000 per time. Uh, 1,000 per cup. Now pepper is 3,000 per cup. We used to buy Maggi. 3, 1,000. Now Maggi is... Uh, 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 we used to buy Maggi. 3, 1,000. Now it's 500. So please, we want to plead to the government, for all the poor people, let them reduce the price because the prices are so expensive. We want, we want to... Uh, uh, we want to appeal to the government because this thing is going out of hand. A trader, Sarah Mansari, who sells pepper 
also had this to say. The Pepe, we buy 450,000. Neneko, we buy 650,000. That's why we pay 3,000 for food. For now, it's reasonable. Let's see the price. Because the Pepe, we buy to move up to 1 million. For now, it's reasonable. So now, how much is for the price? So for the big pet, there's 150,000. Then it's 150,000. So for the layman, how much for the cup? We have 1,000. Come here, my sister. For the big pet, then it's 1,000. My sister, it's 1,000. Dr. Dennis Bright, in his statement, suggested that for the government to succeed, they should work with other political players and that other players outside governance should work with government in the interest of the country and the people he encouraged those in business to be reasonable by not creating unnecessary hardship for the people Papa God, go fast for 